Chris here from Perma Systems, giving you an update on our orchard food forest laboratory. Uh, I just want to show you how some of our new plants are doing and some of our older plants. First off, we have two cold tolerant bananas I planted here just a few days ago. Um, it's Goldfinger and Blue Java, and they're already looking pretty happy. Our Tipuano Tipu nitrogen fixing tree is popping off pretty good. This dragon fruit just had a couple blossoms. I'm not sure if they're going to turn into fruit, but we just planted another um, variety that's the red fleshed. This is the white fleshed. It'd be nice to get some variation. All our plants are looking nice and happy. You can see tons of sorghum growing all over the place. Sorghum loves it here loves our heavy clay soil, and is just exploding. Uh, we still have some later season pumpkins coming up. This is the Big Max pumpkin. Guavas, looking nice and happy. You can see some citrus back in there, loquats, stone fruit. Here's our wahe tree. Look at all those beautiful seeds coming out. Even some arugula popping off. Just uh, self-seeding, mugwort came in on its own. Another one of our guavas. Tomatoes are nice and happy. These ones we are kind of experimenting, just hardly watering them at all, just seeing how they do in our native soil, which they seem quite happy. Cool plant you see in here, it's called Job's Tears, and makes these little seeds that are edible, been used in rosary beads, making art, all kinds of cool things. Sunflowers are going out for the season. Still baby squashes coming. Kai apple is exploding. It's a little edible fruit from uh, South Africa. These giant spikes make a really good fence around your orchard. More pumpkins coming in. The view from the other side. Palo Verde, this guy is like two years old. So happy. And then our macadamia nut tree is growing really well. I've been pruning it, trying to get some better structure out of it and still no um, nuts, but uh, I think next year we'll have a good chance. A uh, few beans coming in. Not sure what those are. Be fun to see. And this has been awesome, our goji berry. This has turned into this amazing ground cover. Spreading out, you can see tons of berries in there. Super yummy and healthy. Especially yummy when dried. <laughs> Pineapple guava, looking happy. The lemon tree is exploding. All our corn did pretty good. It's ready to be turned back into soil. Our strawberry guava here produced fruit for the first time, had quite a few fruits, but um, you know, it wasn't a lot, didn't last long, and the bees, the yellow jackets, went after it quite fast. Our grape from last year, um, planted last year, did good, produced a few grapes, and this new um, citrus uh, is doing quite well. Ice cream bean, super happy, oh man. It just taken off. So incredibly happy. Lots more arugula, com arugula coming in. See more of our macadamias, mulberries, sad macadamia. Not sure what happened, but like maybe it just wasn't meant to be. Um, trying to see if I can get them back, but things are not looking good. More macadamia, macadamia, macadamia. All looking great. Another ice cream bean. Fig. And we have kai apples and pomegranates all along here. Stone fruit behind this pepper tree that's taken off. Gotta have more squashes. <laughs> and uh, see more pomegranates coming in there. We planted some different pine trees in the background. Italian stone pine and Aleppo pine. Doing great. I don't need any extra water. And then over here on kind of the south end, another kai apple coming in and 
two olive trees. So that's kind of the quick uh, tour for now. It's giving you a nice little update, and thanks for checking in.